Today's guest needs no introduction, although I'll introduce him briefly. He is Tim Ferriss. You can you can look at use of smart drugs and find both good examples, informed uh, examples of use, and very haphazard examples of use. And uh, a lot of it comes down to number one, doing your homework, and number two, uh, experimenting and having some ability to track. At some point, the dose to benefit ratio is off, and you could take something that's thought of as very innocuous, like. Water, and you can kill someone through overconsumption of water. So before, like a test, I would put like the vasopressin and yeah. the hydrotine and the modafinil like on the desk in front of me. I'm like, it's only doping if you don't tell everyone, so they have a fair right. advantage. I, I do believe that you know, with great audience comes great responsibility, and you have to assume that you know one out of every thousand fans or readers or or customers you have is completely batshit crazy. So you have so you have to account for that, right? And if you have a million of million people, right? That's a, that's 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 a small army of crazy people. The number of times that the male ejaculates seems to be inversely correlated with lifespan. Yes. So <laughs> that's the bad news. Uh, the, the good news is, at least in my experience, uh, you know, sacrificing myself for science, um, and and I'm looking I'm looking at uh, I want to look at the actual sort of uh, physical determinants of this, and I haven't quite pinpointed it, but I think that if you are ejaculating from sex, uh, that you can do it fairly frequently and still maintain the type of alertness and drive and sort of practical aggression that comes from very healthy, uh, if not optimal, sex hormone levels and so on. I think if you get into that, um, Google dopamine sensitivity and porn, I, I think what's going on there is just higher spikes of dopamine in shorter periods of time, so you get dopamine resistance. Uh, yeah, that's a sure. theory, but I don't know if it's the right theory, but Interesting. I don't know how to test it either. Yeah, you know, that, that could be it, right? It's like insulin resistance. You're yeah. just, it's porn-induced dopamine resistance. <laughs> There's a question that I've asked every guest except that one time when I forgot. And <laughs> the question is, if you had three pieces of advice for people, uh, it, it doesn't it doesn't have to be from any of your books or anything like that, but just your entire life experience, the three most important things to tell people who want to perform better, who want to kick more ass.